welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new. So today's video is going to be a party prep with me for my little guy's first birthday. As many of you know, Jace just turned one a little over a week ago and we wanted to wait until Labor Day weekend for one, because it's a long weekend and for two, because our family is actually able to be here and celebrate with us. So his birthday is going to be wild one themed. I am so excited, it's gonna be so cute and I can't wait to share it with you guys. A lot of the decor honestly has come from around our house, but if it's something that I did purchase I will definitely let you guys know a lot of things were from Hobby Lobby as well and a couple of things from Michaels but I will be sure to share all of that with you guys as we kind of go along tonight I'm gonna actually go ahead and start setting some things up for his party tomorrow just to kind of lessen the load for tomorrow we also already have family in town and so you know they're here to help but we also want to spend time with them and we don't want to be doing all day long party prep tomorrow right before the party because that would be really stressful so we we do not have the food and the cake and everything like that yet. We're going to focus on those kinds of things tomorrow before the party. But for tonight, I want to get as much as I can set up so that it makes tomorrow a lot easier. I am in my toddler's room right now, by the way. And so I know a lot of you guys have had a lot of questions about her room. So I will be doing a toddler room tour here soon because I love it, love it. And guess what, guys? my husband got a new job so we will be moving here within six months so i'm definitely going to make sure that i share this with you before we end up moving i will keep you guys posted here soon on all of the plans for that and so i'm just there are so many things that i get to share with you guys but for today let's focus on some party prep if you have a little one that is turning one this is more of a gender neutral wild one theme so feel free to use any of these tips or ideas let me know in the comments below which ones are your favorite maybe something that you would like to implement for your little one and let me know your little one's ages mine are a year and a half apart if you're new here I have a two and a half year old daughter and a one-year-old now <laughs> son and so they are a year and a half apart but let's go ahead and get to some party prep <laughs> <laughs> all right so here is all of the party decor as you can see there is some greenery we have some pictures just got this greenery from Hobby Lobby. I, I needed a new one of these so I could make a sign. Hopefully I have time to do that. I like this little cheese board that I got. And then just some little things. So I will go ahead and go through all of these as I'm kind of putting it out. But as you can kind of see, we're just doing some neutral rustic touches. And this morning, Eliana and I went to the park and then we collected pine cones. So we're gonna put these kind of around as well. I have this sign that I want to fill out for Jace. And then we have just a couple of other things over here as well. We have some animal crackers. We're going to use these for ice cream cups. I thought those were super cute. These are from Hobby Lobby. And then I pulled some stuff from Jace's room, his nursery as well, because I thought it was perfect for the theme. So these plants and everything are from his room as well. And when I feel the wind on 
Okay, so Chaz and Uncle Brian are blowing up balloons outside right now, and I just wanted to show you guys what we have right here. So I went ahead and put up the TP tent. I ordered this from Amazon. I will link everything in the description box below. Sound like I just popped a balloon. The greenery is from Hobby Lobby. This wild one sign is from Amazon, and I just cut it in half so that I could put it on the TP. It's probably not going to last the entire party because kids are going to be coming in and out. 
And then we have a basket of books down here. Most of these are Usborne books. And I tried to make them wild one themed. So I pulled all of the ones that had little jungle animals in them. So we have monkeys, we have zebras, we have finger wiggly elephants. Don't tickle the tiger, so cute. So they're interactive. So we have a couple of little kids that will be here, not a ton, but they will have something to do by looking at some books that we have. There's fun textures to feel. This one has a mirror and just all kinds of fun things. Um, this one has like big flaps that they can lift. And then I also got this Melissa and Doug puzzle. This is a nice big chunky puzzle that I got from Amazon. So it just has the giraffe, the lion, and the elephant. So this will give them something to do, but it is still within the theme. And of course we have some stuffed animals as well. These are all from Jace's nursery. This one actually sings and it talks too. So it's super cute and the ears flap up and down. It's so cute. So anyway, that's what I have here. This is from Jace's Nursery. It's just a rug. And this play mat is also from Jace's Nursery. This is what the other side looks like, but I went ahead and put the brown side up for the party. But anyway, this is from Milk Made Goods as well. And we had a matching swaddle for him in the hospital with this. So as you guys know, we already had Jace's Cake Smash done. And so we printed some pictures from that. The frames are from Michael's. These little acorn and pine cone things are from Hobby Lobby. All of the greenery is from Hobby Lobby and the pine cones we actually picked up at the park yesterday. We have plates. I found these little ice cream cups at Hobby Lobby. I thought they were so cute. Look at all of the different little animals. We have a lion, an elephant. I know the lighting's not good in here right now. Monkey and okay and then the leopard or cheetah. I'm not sure. And what I'm going to do with the twine is I'm going to just use this to wrap around the mason jars with the plastic wear. Okay, so while they are blowing up balloons, I'm gonna go ahead and finish up here in the kitchen. Yes, I have, look at this regrowth from my hair, you guys, from postpartum, so funny. Thank you, Jace. Just kidding. <laughs> Happy birthday. I am going to go ahead and work in here. We have some cracked chicken going right here, but then we're just going to honestly order pizzas. I am going to make a lion out of hummus and peppers, and I'll have some pretzel sticks as twigs, but everything else is just going to be very easy pizza. We're not going to do a ton of cooking like we usually do, just because it gets to be a lot and then it gets to be kind of stressful. And so um, we are just going to keep it simple this go around. So I have a couple of fun things on the counter here, and then I have some things on the counter over here that I'm going to go ahead and get through this morning. Okay, so this plant is one that we had in Jace's nursery. It's from Amazon, same with the little basket at the bottom. This high chair, we just put this cover on. This is also from Amazon. And I used glue dots. And then this crown I ordered from Etsy for his cake smash. It's a little crumpled since it's been in my car. <laughs> All right, so I'm in a good stopping point for now. I'm gonna go pick up the cake. And then I also need to pick up pictures to put in his newborn through 12 months thing. Yes, I know I'm doing things last minute, but we have a busy life, so that's how it is. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. And then we pretty much have everything else set up. We do have to finish this area over here. We need to put up the word one. And once the balloon garland is done, we'll put that over here. We have to clean the bathroom still since we're having guests. <laughs> and then we just need to push this table back towards the backdrop. Oop, running into things. But that is pretty much how we have everything so far.
right, so this is over on the island and I didn't have time to make a sign for the front door, so I actually am using this sign that I got from Hobby Lobby underneath the tray, and this is where I'm gonna put hummus in the middle and peppers around to make a lion's face. And then over here, I'm just gonna have a little charcuterie, charcuterie <laughs> board. Is that how you say it, babe? I think it's charcuterie. Charcuterie, I anyway. I'm just fine. We're gonna have a little mini charcuterie board over here with some just different things. So anyway, this is all coming together. It looks so cute, I love it. We have animal crackers as our little goodie bags. We kept it super simple. And then all we have left to do over here is finish up the balloons. And then right before the party, we're gonna put the cake here on this tree stump. And I'm gonna add just a few cupcakes over here. And that will pretty much be it. Are you a wild one? Alright, so I hope you enjoyed our party prep wild one themed first birthday video. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it and of course subscribe if you're new and if you would like to see more videos like this. I'm going to go ahead and now switch over to starting to film Jace's first birthday party vlog so that you guys can see how the party goes and all of that. Alright guys, chat soon! Bye!